Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. No, your eyes are not deceiving you. I have a new bullet journal. So if you're interested in knowing more about this, please be sure to stay tuned. Okay, you guys, thank you so much again. Welcome if you're new. Welcome if you are returning. My name again is Brandy Janae, and on this channel, I am primarily a cash-based budgeter who is on the road to financial freedom, and I'm doing this by playing savings challenges and games, and I am also a planner babe. So, <sighs> you guys, I have been, <laughs> y'all know, y'all know, if you've been following me for a while, you know, I have been through the planner journey, but what I can say with all of everything that's in my being, my absolute favorite planner system has always, 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 always been the bullet journal. And it's funny because my bestie and I had like our little planner meetup today. I'm filming this on a Monday. My uh, bestie and I, we had a planner meetup and she was just like, you always go back to the bullet journal. And I'm like, because it literally is my favorite thing. And she's like, well, you say that now, but you'll probably switch it again in a little bit. And I'm like, here's the thing. I realized recently that the reason why the bullet journal did not work for me in the beginning is because A, I was brand new to bullet journaling because I had just learned about it on YouTube. And B, I was brand new to actually like, legit trying to have a YouTube channel. So I didn't know really too much about bulk filming. I wasn't really prepared with, you know, how to edit and how to do all of those things. So like I took on two major things at the exact same time. Now, what I will say is that this bullet journal will always be ahead. So whatever week I'm planning in here, because that was another thing that was also my downfall, whatever week I'm planning in here will be for future and not for present. <laughs> so with that being said, I may not do every week in here. I may not show you every week in here. Some week it may just be flip throughs, you know, and all of that. So we'll just kind of see how it plays out as far as what I'm filming. But I don't want filming to be the reason why I stopped doing ultimately what I love. So I have this beautiful notebook from Archer and Olive. It is like a linen co cover, which does get scratched very easily. If that bothers you, don't get the linen. It doesn't really bother me because I don't really baby my planners, but I love it because it says you got this, which is like the perfect sentiment for the phase I'm in right now. And of course, if you know Archer and Olive, it comes with these beautiful bookmarks with their logo on it. Forgive my hands, y'all. I just, I'm doing bulk filming and I just did my budget video and this is Sharpie. <laughs> so then when you open it up, you have this beautiful gold foiled like floral pattern here. I have not put my name in here yet because I'm still trying to decide if I want to write it or if I want to use vinyl. So I'll get there. My first page, I put this in here because I absolutely love Poe. Poe is my favorite sweet kawaii character. It's Poe. It's Poe. I love how sweet Poe is, but I also love how sassy Poe is. So Poe is like a Sour Patch Kid to me. Love, 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 love Poe. Um, so I, oh, that is one thing I should mention. This book is going to be exclusively Sweet Kawaii Design. So the only thing in here that will not necessarily be from Sweet, Sweet Kawaii Design is going to be like scripts and boxes because sometimes I just want to write on a regular box and not on the, um, vinyl boxes. So that'll be the only thing that you see that is not from Sweet Kawaii. And that's because Sweet Kawaii also, <laughs> out of all of my stickers, Sweet Kawaii brings me the most joy. Now that's not to say that I don't love my other stickers because I really, 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 really do. But what's going to bring an ultimate, like no matter what, make me come back and look at it a thousand times a day kind of smile. It has always been Sweet Kawaii. It's cute. It's, you know, just, just, Kawaii. <laughs> like that's that's pretty much it. So my other planners, especially like my faith one, you'll see more of, you know, just all of the stickers that I have and then in when I start using my daily planner again, you'll see like all of the stickers I have. So I have plenty of space to put those other stickers even when I'm like doing my creative journal cuz I'm just going through something, you'll see the other stickers. So, but in this particular book, nothing but sweet Kawaii. 
I'm going to put that out there. So here we have this. I love this. So don't ever let anyone burst your bubble. This is Frank. He has his little bubbles. So I did my best attempt <laughs> to draw my own little bubbles over here. I put him in and then the year for this book. And I love it. I could add more bubbles, but I don't want it to get like overloaded. So we're just going to stop there. But I think it's cute. Then we have our future log, which Amanda and I started filling in today. I <laughs> duck it. <laughs> do what makes you happy so this is going to be like this is my goals page so my like regular personal goals is to save 5k by the end of the year walk three times per week for 30 minutes start journaling and actually journal bullet journal for the rest of the year <laughs> that's the that's my goal uh, i need to put on here reading is this the right pen yes I don't think this is what I used though. I think I used a, uh, what did I use on this? That's okay, we're gonna put this down. Five, yeah, definitely a different pen. Read 30 books. I don't remember what I put in my book journal, but that's what I want to do is read 30 books. Okay. And then for Brandy Janae, like social media, Etsy shop, all that jazz. I want to do 3K subs by basically the end of the year, December, 40 to 50 Etsy sales per month, five to seven videos per week. Two more vendor fairs. I've already done two. I would like to do two more before the end of the year. And then my goal is going to be two reels slash shorts per month oh, so hard that is like out of all of these things <laughs> that's like the hardest one for me because i just by the time i finish doing all these videos i don't feel like doing reels and shorts so here is may i love it so this was actually one of those jumbo stickers and have the other ones that you pull out and take off like the little mini stickers i decided that this part was still very usable i drew my own little basket at the bottom i know the color isn't exactly the same but i was like eh, it's close enough and then i just added this little quote from i don't know what stickers that came from but anyway it's cute added some washi to the bottom i have my may cover page so as you can see the theme for may is cherries and strawberries so like a fruit theme here is my week one love it here is i already have set up for week two and then this is where we are we are setting up june for today so <laughs> this cracks me up because literally the other day i asked y'all know her name i'm not gonna say it because i don't want everybody to start going off but i asked her what the temperature was and she was like oh it's the high is gonna be like 80 whatever and i was like ew <laughs> And then as I'm flipping through my book, I see this sticker and I'm like, yep, my, this is exactly how I feel about being too hot. So I want to check my camera. I am going to put this sticker over here. I love, 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 love these jumbo stickers. And I think they are just perfect. So if for some reason I don't have, you know, any type of thing that I want to put on this side, we're gonna use a jumbo. So we are going to line this up. It's probably not gonna be perfectly straight but that's okay oh i could have went up a little bit higher again that's okay <laughs> let's get these air bubbles out that's not bad love it ah! i love it love it love it love it love it okay so then on this page i want to put this hello summer here in the middle, another thing I forgot to grab. Let's 
I forgot to grab my scripts. Y'all, see, I'm not ready. Hold on. Okay, my bad, you guys. <laughs> Isn't this video off to an amazing start? Okay, so I want to put... Oh man, I used it already. Do I have it in the colorful version? Yay! Okay. I'm like, I want June on here. Because that's what month we're in. So, June. Put there. And I don't think I have any... I'm pretty sure I took them out already. Okay. So let's do... I want some more like deco stickers. Okay, guys, sorry. One moment. Okay, sorry. In my mind, I had this all... This was all planned out and ready. <laughs> Clearly my mind and my reality are two totally different things but yeah i want some little deco stickers on here because it just makes everything cuter and these like this kit that i'm using here is actually for the Hobonichi weeks. But as you can see, it works. Okay. All right, so let's push this to the side. All right, so there is the opening page. Now we're going to do page one, which is June 3rd, th page one, spread one, which is June third through the ninth i already took the time to put the dates on and another thing that was easier for me was to go ahead and just do the layouts again that was another thing i feel like i messed up on before is i would try to do the layouts on film like as far as drawing the lines yeah that doesn't work for me it takes too long like i mean as much as i love doing this i don't really have an hour worth of film time to you know record like, because I can literally draw lines while I'm laying in bed. It doesn't have to be a formal sitting, but trying to do it that way, you know, draw the lines and film them, film that process makes your videos go from like 20 minutes or so to like, I mean, some of my videos were literally over an hour. So trying to speed them up or edit it down was just, it was a lot. So now I'm like, well, if you have all the lines drawn beforehand, then that'll cut down a lot of your time because you can have the lines drawn for the whole month. All right, so this is June. That is really crooked. It's probably still crooked, but not as crooked. <laughs> Okay, whatever. All right, so this is June 3rd through the 9th. I know that technically June, summer has not started yet at this point, but that's okay. I love it. Okay, so we are going to put this here. And I'm going to layer this. the box so down in this section I plan on writing my 
like highlight for the week, something really cool that happens up here. I'm going to attempt to squeeze in a scripture. <laughs> um, because, yeah, it'll just, I usually write down the one scripture for the week just so I can make sure that I have some, um, you know, something to read throughout the week. I do want to put some of these on here. And of course, you know, I could have been proactive and checked to see what my plans are, but I wasn't. So we're just gonna, we're gonna just put them in. Should still give me plenty of room to write Mm. Maybe we'll hold off on this one. And these are technically boxes that you can either write in. So they're, you know, the half boxes. <laughs> so I can either write in them or they are just super cute sun deco. And I'm here for it either way. And since... That... Uh, Okay, here it is. I'm like, what? Okay, so since these boxes have stickers, we're gonna put washi in these boxes. And that'll kind of fill up some of the space. So these boxes will, oopsie, oh no, Brandy. So vinyl stickers are pretty good at being removable. However, comma, they really like to stick to themselves. <laughs> so you have to be careful. Okay. I love that. Uh, okay. I love this so much. And the coolest thing about doing this as well is that a bullet journal really works for both types of people. It works for the people that enjoy drawing <laughs> and doodling and, you know, all of those things. But then it also works for people like me that are sticker people and that do not prefer to draw or anything like that. Now, with that being said, I still have the drawing option, which is super cool because, you know, with, with blank pages, you can kind of choose what you want. You can also choose what you want your layouts to look like and, you know, how many pages you want per layout. And there's just so many options with the Bujo, and that's just what I love about it the most is that I can literally decide week to week what kind of planner I want to use all in this one planner. So the likelihood of me getting bored is much, 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 much slimmer <laughs> because a week will never look the same as another week. Okay, so this is it. We have our June cover page. Um, so cute. I may add some more to this. 
let's do do, do these go I wonder if these are long enough to go across the top we're gonna learn today yes it's like I mean it's almost perfect it is okay that makes me feel much better okay it's less just blank at the top <laughs> okay so we have this page which is our cover page i love it and then we have our first week of june i am going to do the other weeks of june which i already have laid out and then i will show you this at another time so thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not already done so. I would love for you to become a part of the Brandy Janae family. Speaking of which, in case you did not know, I do have memberships. Also, I don't know if you can see the membership option from your phone, but you can definitely see it from like a computer. So if you're interested in learning more about the memberships on my channel, be sure to check that out as well. You guys are absolutely amazing. Be safe, be kind, or be quiet, be well, and I'll catch you in the next one.